Hello, this is Mike at Game from Scratch, and welcome to what is actually a pretty big deal. Uh, today, FMOD IO was launched. Now, if you've never heard of it, FMOD is probably the preeminent middleware uh, software out there for audio in games. It's been around for years and years and years, and has been used in literally hundreds, possibly thousands of games. And it is integrated into uh, many really popular game engines, such as Unreal and Unity. Like, FMOD is pretty much the audio middleware out there. And today they released FMOD Studio 1.08. And that news isn't really that special. Uh, well, it's nice, you know, it, it added some new functionality like PlayStation VR support, uh, new Dolby integration, and most importantly, they added FMOD IO integration. And FMOD IO is what we should all be very excited about. And what it is, is big basically an asset store or cloud-based store for purchasing sound effects. And that on its own doesn't really sound that special until we look at the details. Now, they've just launched FMOD IO. Now, you can't download anything through FMOD IO. You actually have to use FMOD Studio, uh, which you can grab from fmod.org forward slash download. It's free download, so there's no cost involved there. And there's clients for Windows and Mac. So you're going to need to use FMOD Studio to access FMOD IO. And FMOD IO is a huge library of licensable sound effects. And where it gets cool is first the license, second the price, and third the scope. And let's do those in reverse order. First off, scope. There's 500 plus sound effects in there. So FMOD has created, over the last 20 years, sound effects for just about everything. And so if you need to sample a sound effect for in your game, chances are it's in FMOD. Next up is the price. And this is also pretty magical. Every single sound effect in the library, 99 cents. Yeah. 99 cents it's yours and then finally the license and the license is what makes or breaks this kind of stuff you know obviously if you can't ship it with a commercial game what good is it and good news here you can and the other thing is you are licensing that sound effect pretty much for life so you can use it in whatever product you want the only real regulations or restrictions there is you can't uh, give them away for free so you can't give it to a buddy and say here's a sound effect have fun with it and you can't resell it as a sound effect so you can sell it as part of a game but you couldn't obviously you know buy 50 of their sound effects and just bundle them off and you know call it your own sound effect pack and resell it so those are the limitations of the license but you can reuse it you can use it uh, in any game engine you don't need to use fmod so if you had your own engine you rolled from scratch and you just want to use this as a sound effect source you can so you don't have to work with fmod's technology to use these things at that license you can reuse them it doesn't even have to be a game it could be in any application you want um so obviously it also will, is, works very well. It is integrated directly into FMOD, which in turn, as I said earlier, was integrated into Unreal and Unity. Now, another part of this is as of right now, there is a promotion on where the first 50 free sound effects. Uh, so you sign in and you have to use an FMOD account, but you sign in in FMOD uh, Studio and the first 50 ones you download are completely free. So that's kind of nice, especially a lot of games uh, will probably have 50 or less sound effects. And I will show you in a second just the scope of what is available. Now, another part that's really cool is in the future, um, and hopefully near future, which is what I get when I read the words coming soon. But they're also bringing in a huge uh, library, thousands they say, of loopable music clips. So it's going to get to the point where we can even license our um, music through this system. And hopefully it's got a comparable pricing system. Now, looping music might, uh, sorry, licensing music this way might be a little bit more samey when you got a lot of people using the same source material. Whereas if you're looking at a, a, a catalog of 500,000 sound effects, even if two or three games use the same sound effect, it's not going to be so obvious. But you could probably get that with music. Or, you know, a couple of tracks get pretty popular and you start sounding very samey from game to game. But we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. So that's not even here yet. But in the future, they're offering uh, music as well, which is definitely cool. But here we go. This is FMOD Studio. I'm not going to get into at all what FMOD Studio does. It does a whole bunch. It's beyond me. I'm not an audio guy. Uh, basically, I just basically take effects as they are, or I do any of the mixing or changing inside of my engine. Uh, but it can be done here in the editor. And that's not really what we're here for. What we're here for is to see FMOD IO. And as I mentioned earlier, in order to access FMOD IO, you need to have FMOD Studio. Um, so what you want to do once you've got it loaded is load up the audio bin window right here. And you'll see there's a tab at the top. So this is where all of your particular sound effect assets would be. And then here, 
is where FMOD IO integration comes in. And this is really cool. So generally you would have to sign in with your account if you're gonna make some purchases, and I'm not going to. I'm just gonna show you uh, the breadth and volume of what's there and some of the previews of the sound effect. And let's start with something really simple, gunshots. So gun. So we're gonna go here for gun sounds. And let's go ahead and search. You're getting an idea of the volume we're talking about here. So here's all of the gun noises. And we're talking like there's a sniper rifle and there's eight different versions of sniper rifle sounds and hopefully that's not extremely loud on your end if it is i apologize uh gun mags oh magnum gun dry fire now let's go something a little bit different let's search for say audi what kind of audi sound effects we got oh look we have the sound of an audi horn from the outside of the car I hate that noise. Uh, we have the sound of the horn from the inside. We have the sound of... Uh, it's just staggering, the sheer volume. The trunk You need the trunk closed sound for an Audi. There it is. Not the most impressive sound effect. Uh, and then you can see down here the sampling rates. Um, so it's, it's a stereo sound effect, two channels, 44.1 kilohertz, uh, 0.9 seconds. And then you also see here, there's a lot of times that the sound effect will have uh, multiple instances. For example, here you can see if I grab this guy, uh, there's one and it's 99 cents. But if I look at this guy, there's three. And I can actually buy them as a pack and get a 10% discount. And that's consistent across the board. You'll see it. If there's 100, it would be 90 bucks um, or just under $89 or whatever. So it's a huge volume of, of sound effects. And you, again, you could just use FMOD Studio to access this guy, download them. Um, so you just purchase it right here, which obviously I can't because I'm not signed in. But you would just like you know using iTunes, it will download the file locally. And then you can grab generally any file you have open is going to be just saved to your file system. So you don't even have to use it in FMOD. You can just go to the underlying file system and use it however you want. So this is actually a potentially a huge deal. So now game developers have access to a huge volume of professionally made game sound effects for uh, trinkets like 99 cents is an awesome price especially with that license detached now if i was somebody that was making sound effects as a freelancer i would look at this and go oh god no but for everybody else this is awesome news so um, if you're making your own game and you were looking for some professional sound effects at uh, this is probably your best choice at this point in time and i wonder if we will see them go the mixamo route and offer an all you can eat uh subscription somewhere down the road uh, that would be cool to see but i'm just speculating on that one uh, and it'll also be interesting to see when they do add music uh what the pricing is going to be there so anyways that is um fmod io and i honestly think this is a huge deal uh let me know what you think in the comments down below see you later bye